For many years now, I've been a storyteller, telling stories orally to audiences. And I continue to do so. But I also continue to study others who are good storytellers, who can present to audiences orally. And I've kept notes over the years. In fact, I have, must be half a dozen thick notebooks, such as this one here. And I'd like to mention a fellow called Peter Guba. Now, Peter Guba, I'm very impressed with what he had to say in a video I saw on YouTube. The title of that presentation was called The Art of Powerful Storytelling. And here's what Peter says, without reading it all the way through. We're in the emotional transference business. We're in the emotional transference business. Don't try to motivate. Don't try to motivate them. Motivate yourself. You're telling about the benefits to you. So if there's a personal story which has made a great difference in your life, something which has really changed your life for the better, and you feel really moved about it, even now, it might be years later, you'll have the passion, the enthusiasm to tell that to the audience, to bring that home to the audience. Render experiences to the listener. So in other words, when you tell your story, make it a moving picture in their minds. The moving picture created by your words, but interpreted in their words and put into a moving picture in their minds. He gives a couple of tips. Number one, you motivate yourself, which I've already said. You bring yourself into a state so that you are authentic, genuine, sincere, and therefore trusted. The audience want to trust you, and they will trust you if you are speaking from your heart and you are being very genuine. You are bringing something which has really moved you, still moves you, that story, to your audience. Tip number two, you have to be interested in your audience. You have to be interested in that audience. Don't try to be interesting so much as interested. They can capture what you want through their interests. I think you will find that's very accurate. Most of the stories I tell are entertaining stories and are not coming from personal experience. Although, in some of them, I am personally observed, uh, personally involved, but I'm talking about those stories which you don't simply tell to entertain. You tell to trans transform your audience. You're a transformational speaker telling a story which you're hoping will bring your audience some great benefits, some insight, some truth, some profound story in your life that you want to bring to the audience so that they can improve their lots, live happier lives, feel more joy. These are the stories that you really want to tell. These are the stories that are bursting from your heart. These are the stories that everyone has within them. There's always a personal story 
or several personal stories which have made a great difference in your life. These are the stories that you need to bring to your audience. Be interested in your audience. Be interested in improve, improving their lots. And that way you will be, you'll be better received by that audience.